We end tonight with the Sunday sit down. This week's guest is Tin Caps manager Jose Valentin. A native of Manatee, Puerto Rico, Valentin played 16 years in the major leagues and grew up in a family where baseball dominated everyday life. What was your introduction to the game like growing up? Um, it was it's something that, uh, like I say, it was uh, baseball in our in our family. It's just pretty much it's, it's almost like in our blood. I mean, um, our family. Everything started with my dad. My dad was a player that uh, never played professional baseball, um, but he played a lot of years for the national team, Puerto Rico. And uh, you know, we grew up in a small town that, uh, I mean, Puerto Rico is so, it's, it's so small that you can go around in five hours. And how, how, how small the, uh, the Puerto Rico is. Our house grew up with real close, it's just like walking distance from, uh, from, from the ballpark. And um, I grew up in a project that, uh, it, it was it was real poor, and I uh, mean, you know, there's a lot of things, a lot of bad things going on there. When you were 18, you signed your your first major league deal. Ironically enough, with the Padres, and now here you are working in their in their organization. What did that represent for you, and what did that represent for your family? Uh, it was uh, it was a day that I never forget. Um, something that um, you know, be myself as a professional player. Um, you know. And when I signed, when I signed a contract, I didn't, I didn't sign because I just want to be, um, make a lot of million, do I mean, million dollars, and make a lot of money. I just, like I said, I just want to sign. Uh, I signed because I just want to be a good player. You mentioned that as a player, uh, you wanted to be a role model, and you talked about the importance of Roberto Clemente in, in your home country growing up. During your career, on several occasions, uh, you were finalists for the Roberto Clemente Award. Uh, I know that you won the team award for that with the White Sox. What did that mean to you to be up for that award on so many occasions during your career? It's mean a lot because uh, um, it shows uh, it shows that uh, that I not only was recognized about a player that I was, but also I was recognized I was a good uh, human being that I was off the field, and that was something that I was keeping in mind when I was playing baseball. You know, you got to be a professional player. I mean, you got to be a professional. In and out. It doesn't matter only when you wear your baseball uniform. You have to be a professional. But uh, I think the the hardest part is how to be a professional when you're off the field. You mentioned your oldest son, uh, as you said, who recently signed with with the Dodgers after being drafted by them. I know that you flew home for a few days to be with him for that. What was that like for you, seeing him reach that level? It was something that uh, um, it was a relief. It was a lot of happiness. Um, it was a moment that. Uh, that I think all oh, many years that I play in the big league, uh, I never had so much fun and I never was so happy. Um, and, and from that moment, you know, see my son, see um, be you know, be trapped by the by the professional team.